What's going on, YouTube? It's your boy Young Wu back with some more on the block news, man. I'm in a city right now, man. I'm getting, you feel me? Like truth tellers say, man, I'm getting the, I'm, I'm tasting the air, I'm smelling the air, you feel me? I'm in the environment, you feel me? Funny ass nigga. But anyway, man, make sure you hit that like, hit that subscribe button, hit that notification bell, man. Not later, but right now. Listen, man, make sure y'all checking out my website on the block.com for that fly merch I got, like them fly ass shirts I rock. You feel me? Y'all can order physical copies to my music. Block Music 1, 2, 3, and 4. I just dropped Block Music 4. You can stream all of them on every platform you can think of. But listen, man. Today I'm going to be talking about this shit I seen earlier, man. You feel me? And I hurry up and uh, screen recorded the video. I, I got to figure out where I'm going to post these type of shit because I'm not really into posting. You feel me? These type of videos. Plus, they, they try to delete your channel all that shit. But anyway, you feel me? Before I read the story to y'all, I'm going to just tell y'all what I seen. Feel me? You see two... Two niggas in a gray hoodie, you feel me? They look like they they trying to they fuck with each other, you feel me? About the same height, you feel me? Like like good friends would be good close homies would be or whatever, you feel me? But the nigga, you feel me, on the right side, you feel me? I guess he not he comfortable around whoever the nigga he walk away because he feel like he his friend. The nigga pull out the strap, you feel me, from his waistline and and shot him two times on a in a I would say in the back of the head, but like angled sort to the side to the back to the side type shit. Feel me popped him two times on the head, you feel me? Like that shit was so sad. You feel me? The first thing a nigga think about is the movie paid in full. You feel me? That's the first thing a nigga think about. Then the second thing a nigga think about is, you know, with with Lil Durk and them be talking about that back door shit. You feel me? And the third thing I think about, you feel me? Like how I think in my thought process, you feel me? Like I, I just wonder what that what that kid could have done, you feel me? Because based on what his daddy said, you feel me, super smart, you feel me, look like a square, like a motherfucker, you feel me? But the first thing that came to my mind is, like, you feel me, this nigga's doing that, doing that right there for free. Like, that was some backdoor shit, whether he knew him or not. Like, he ain't run up on that man and let him see him. Like, he shot him, you feel me, what, he made the dude comfortable with, to where he was able to pop, pop him in his head, you feel me? So... First thing I think about it, well, the third thing, like I said, the third thing I think about is how I think. Like, it's niggas out here doing that shit for free. You feel me? And when, when he watched the Pay the Full movie, that nigga Rico, you feel me? He did it. He he got some bricks with it. You feel me? It was a money monetary. I'm not saying I condone that shit, but I justify it. Rico was wrong anyway. You feel me? But I'm saying I learned from that situation. You feel me? I see what niggas do when it's money thrown in their faces. You feel me? So, you know, first thing a nigga think about, nigga, as soon as a nigga touch a bag, you feel me? A nigga don't want to post it. A nigga don't want to brag on it. You feel me? Because I know that, you feel me, opposition, your enemies, they can't get to you. You feel me? It be the motherfuckers close to you, like your friends and shit. Hey, no, you feel me? So I just do my thing and I hustle and I try not to show too much because I don't trust niggas. Like, it's niggas doing that shit for free. So what a nigga do for for for, for a Cuban link chain? You feel me? For, for, some, for some Dolce Gabbana shoes to come with it. They didn't get nothing out of it from what the camera saw, you feel me? So, and the reason why this story right here resonated with me because, you know, it's backdoor season, you feel me? So, I like, a lot of people give me backdoor vibes. They give me set-up vibes. Motherfuckers calling my phone out the blue, trying to do any type of business, nigga. On my mama, any type of business. If I ain't never got no money for with you, niggas, nigga, I'm done at 30, nigga. I ain't got no money with you ever before in 30 years, nigga. There's no need for me to get no money with you now. You feel me? Especially if I've been knowing you the whole damn 30 years. You feel me? Like I said, like, new people, they don't give me backdoor instead of, uh, you feel me? Because I'm already, you got to understand, when you meet new people, you already got your guard up. You already, it's already a, a natural guard, like, who? because you don't know the person. You feel me? And it's a natural, let your guard down. You naturally, for people you trust and you love, you naturally let your guard down, you feel me, and get comfortable around them. You feel me? So with me, that's why me, I... I look over my shoulder, my head always on the swivel, kind of paranoid. You can say I suffer from post-traumatic stress, you feel me? But I don't really trust nothing, you feel me? Shit like this only make it worse, you feel me? Because that was just a movie paid in full I was watching, and I didn't watch that movie over 100 times. And each time, got some type of new thing from it, some some I can use to my life, some type of learning experience from watching the movie. You feel me? These niggas out here, man, they had set you up. It don't matter how long a nigga knew you. I don't know how long that nigga knew that guy right there. But you feel me? I done heard some stories. You feel me? Uh, 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 shit like that happening. You feel me? 
outside of movies, you feel me, in real life experience that I, I will not bring to this platform, you feel me, due to, you know, my, my personal beliefs and everything, you feel me, but this shit happened in real life, hood to hood, block to block, you feel me, like, that looked like that was his homies, like, homies kill a homies, my nigga, I swear to God, homies kill a homies, and we seen, we witnessed that right there, because that ain't, because, listen, I'm not even finna have a nigga walk, I'm not finna walk in the back of no alley with man, nigga, you feel me, if I don't know him. You feel me? Like, so the nigga had to know him, you feel me? To be honest with you, after watching that video, I don't even be in no damn alleys. I don't even be in, I don't even be in no damn alleys, you feel me? So I'm not going to add no alley, listen, with nobody. So ain't no nigga about to call my phone, give me the link up with nobody. No money plays, nothing, my nigga. I'm real picky with everything and I don't trust shit. So yeah, you know, I'm a I'm a easy going dude, you feel me? Like I, I try not to show what I'm thinking or what I'm feeling, you feel me, through my actions. So yeah, like I'm a I'ma play that game with you. You wanna be on some fake shit, act like you fuck with me. I'ma make you think I believe you fuck with me. Oh yeah, like yeah, that nigga yeah, I'm gonna make you believe that I think you fuck with me, but at the end of the day I don't trust I don't trust that nigga, you feel me? I be peeping how niggas move, you feel me? This in my own personal life, you feel me? Like I be people how niggas move and I don't trust it. Like a lot of niggas show their emotions through Instagram. Like the nigga that was walking that got popped, the other nigga probably already sold his hand and already said some jealous shit. Already been a hater, you feel me? It could be the fact that the nigga smart in school. The nigga probably called him dumb or something. Listen, that's the thing about it. Like, you feel me? I'm a street nigga, you feel me? So I understand beef. And to me, beef don't ever stop because, all right, you never know what the next man thinking. Like, you feel me? Years can go by. Years can go by. You probably said something to a nigga, did something to a nigga. A nigga, a nigga will hold that grudge against you until the right time and kill you, whether you know you or not. My nigga on my mama. So, you feel me? I, I know these things. So, before anything can possibly happen to me, I'm already looking for like, damn, that's a possibility. If I move this way, that can happen. You feel me? If I trust this nigga, like, I don't, I don't really like who this nigga connected to. You feel me? Like, yeah, we, we cool and everything, but this nigga ain't getting no money like I'm getting money. Like, I ain't been around this nigga in years. Like, I ain't on this, I ain't at this nigga mama house, these niggas mama houses on their mama couch no more. Like, I'm I'm at my own couch. Like, I'm at my own house. Like, you feel me? Like, I don't know what niggas going through in their life right now. You feel me? So, I don't even believe a nigga can tell me he love me. Like, you feel me? Like, real shit. You feel me? But y'all be safe out there, man. Back door season, like, back door season is, is never closed. Like, this shit never stopped. Like, I mean, I've been hearing about niggas shit like this happening before I was able to just see this shit on camera like this, you feel me, like Marika on real life with no money involved, you feel me, these niggas uh, do anything for free, like these niggas will kill you for free, you feel me that's why, me I don't know about y'all, but I done, been, I done been around some pistols and shit, right, I done been around guns and shit, you feel me, but it's always like an uncomfortable feeling being around people with they guns like i'm comfortable with my shit like i know what i'm gonna do with it i'm gonna i know what i'm gonna do with this motherfucker but like you don't know what the next nigga thinking it's it's nothing but a nigga to up his pistol on you and blow your top back like it's that simple like a nigga probably just want to crash out and say fuck everybody and nigga just peel your top back you feel me and it'll be the grimy niggas and niggas with low self-esteem niggas that got nothing to lose that'll do it that's why i don't fuck with niggas who got nothing to lose to be honest I like fucking with people that got similar minds to mine. I don't give a fuck where you come from, what hood you from. Yo, your mind got to think like me. Like, I, I want to see how you treat your people. Like, if you a nigga that say you love your people, but you don't provide for your people. You don't do nothing for your people. You don't even get no money to provide for yourself. Like, you feel me? I'm a nigga that say I love mine and I do for that. I do for mine, you feel me? I do for mine. I'm able to do for mine. I show real love, you feel me? So you niggas can't even provide for their own 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 life, their own self. So can't no, ain't no nigga that can't provide for his own self or his family can ever say they love me. I mean, I don't trust these niggas. But anyway, uh, I'm going to get back with y'all soon, man. Let me know what y'all think in the comments. Rest in peace to the young man that lost his life due to the backdoor shit going on. You feel me? Open your eyes, man. Listen, all these motherfuckers that be around y'all, if they say some slick shit, man, you better watch them. You better watch them. I, listen, I watch a nigga post. I don't say nothing. You feel me? You want to get my mind... I'll gotta get to the next section. You wanna you wanna know what's on my mind? 
you gonna have to come to my YouTube. I don't post how I feel. I don't post nothing illegal or none of that shit. I don't post how I think. Like when I be finding myself about to type in what's on my mind. Like when I think about it, like motherfuckers don't even care what's on my mind. If they do, they gonna hit this like and subscribe button and they gonna run a views up and be subscribed to my channel. Motherfuckers don't even care. They just wanna know. You feel me? They wanna know my problems. They don't give a fuck about if I say, man, I just, I just, nigga hit for a million, nigga, unless they gon' unless they plotting, nigga, or unless they think they finna get something. You feel me? But anyway, man, hit that like, hit that subscribe button, hit that notification bell, man. Not later, but right now, my name is Young Woo. This is On the Block News.